Hey everybody, this is Sticky Hamster, and I'm going to show you a free-to-play game on Steam here. This is Fishing Planet. This was recommended to us by one of our viewers, and uh, the best way for me to describe this is, so far, is fishing without mosquitoes. No Zika virus here. That's right. He's absolutely right. That's a song we played yesterday. Controller is not vibrating. I wonder if I can turn that on in options. Okay. I, guys, I'm going to restart it one more time, and I want to see if I can configure it completely for controller. One moment, everybody. Yeah, I tell you, I'm new at something. I'm new at it, that's for sure. Settings. Controls. Controller. Vibration was turned off. Vibrate is if line is not tensioned. I have no idea what that means. We'll put them on. Okay. Save and play. There we go. The absolute realistic simulator party. Uh, send me a friend request on Steam, dude. And you can take a look at my full list of games. I do have lots of games. Even though I have controller enabled, it's still telling me to the uh, keyboard controls. If the controller vibrates this time. That's cool. Yeah, I like that. Oh, release. Okay. It's kind of neat as the bobber is moving around. You, if a fish is, is like barely, you kind of feel the controller like move a little first, just a second. Nice casual game. Actually, I don't know if there would be this would be casual. This game gets advanced, doesn't it? Yeah, the vibration feature is pretty cool. The controller is just kind of barely like doing the little vibration thing right now. Oh. Okay. See if you can open inventory from the controller. Looks like you can't open inventory from the controller, so you have to use the keyboard for that. Okay, drag and drop to set red worms as bait. Okay. Target fish, crappy bluegill, pumpkin seed, uh, red ear sunfish, yellow perch, uh, common shiner, watermouth. This is a lightweight bait. I don't know what 25 means, but we'll drop this here. Now let's go to the local shop to get a fish keeper. Goes an equipment. Buy a fish stringer to keep your catch. You have purchased a fish jail stringer short. 
The magfin fish stringer is designed to hold fish and keep them alive in fresh water. Using a special magfin needle, the snap is threaded through the fish gill and out through its mouth, which allows the fish to breathe freely through its gills. The vinyl coated stainless steel cable provides high strength and durability. Despite all the advantages of a fish stringer, it could damage fish, so if you're going to release the fish at the end of your fishing trip, you should use a keep net instead. Okay, we're also here now open the lake map. Bigger fish prefers a good hiding place. Let's select, select a different fishing spot. I want to go over here because they're telling me to. So we're fishing here in New York at Midland Charm. This lovely fishing spot around the West Bank of Emerald Lake is a perfect sunrise view location with an area of Midland Charm. Here the shallow, shallow sandy shore gradually descends to its untamed depth and the placid statue still surface of the lake is disturbed only by the occasional crappy hunting just under its surface of the water to feast on unsuspecting flies. At the smell of damp grass and wet sand overwhelms your senses, let all your worries dissolve and concentrate in peaceful meditation as you fish the day away for chain pickerel and trout hiding in the tree roots and weed beds just offshore. Let's do it. Okay, now we can go to the pier. Oh, that's how many of them I have, so, okay, thank you. Okay. Cast my bait near the lily pads. Float is on its side because the bait hit the bottom. Consider the depth and adjust the rig accordingly. Reel in. Change the line leader to 19 inches by pressing O and P. Line leader. Hold that down. Okay. Good, now recast to the same spot and wait for your catch. I guess the line leader is the part underneath the bobber, right? All right, we're waiting for a fishy. Okay, it's starting to wiggle. It's a wiggling, just barely. It we're going it's this is so cool with the controller that's neat I feel it wiggling that can be a very creepy thing okay our first trophy catch good job open the lake map to continue your adventure you can leave the lake now and go home like a real winner Back home, make sure you want to leave, yes. This was one good fishing day. Check out your results and rewards. So we got a uh, crappy, almost a pound. They give me six dollars. Click left mouse button or press space to close. You have to pay for travel cost. Or fish one trophy fish. 42 stars, six dollars three coins a daily bonus when traveling you pay for the trip and for every day of fishing so it's cheaper to travel for numerous days the bigger the fish keeper the more fish you can keep at the end of your fishing day at the end of every fishing day you get a reward for all fish that are in your fish keeper yeah, they need a like a special attachment so you can plug into USB to let you taste the fish, man. Plan your fishing trips wisely and you will profit. I'm now level two. Delivered a basic pack. And so we have different places where we can go fishing here. Here in the center, down here. It's sunny here. It's uh, rainy here. And we have different areas that are already locked. Let's go here where it's rainy. I 
Or should we go here? Let's see. This is the this is where I up here. Okay, check this out. I, this is where I, my my dude lives. This is Missouri home state. So we'll go here. But but then that says I'm I'm already in Texas. There's no travel cost. Let's go let's go here since there's no cost. Okay. Did I get any of the DLC? No, I have not spent any money on this game yet. And don't know if I will. I really like it, I might someday. I don't know. Okay, welcome to this little piece of heaven you can call your own. A lovely wooden house on the bank of the Lone Star Lake. Hidden in a remote rural area of Paris County, Texas. Only a few decades ago, Lone Star Lake was a nameless little pond amidst picturesque Texan wilderness. Owing to the efforts of local anglers, the pond was turned into a beautiful lake inhabited by many fish species like white crappie, golden shiner, redder sunfish, bluegill, and blacktail shiner. Any angler dreams of living in a place like this, and now this dream is turning real. So grab your fishing rod and walk down the gradually sloping bank of the lake's clear waters to test your sight on the idyllic rural view of the opposite shore with its distant hills and cornfields. Truly, there's no place like home, the place you'll always want to go back to. Let's go fishing. I got my fishing stuff. So, I want to go fishing for land sharks, man. Oh, apparently there's like a chat thing here. So this is, is this multiplayer? This is like an MMO with fishing. How about that? Neat. Um, I want to fish off this little dock over here, or this little bridge. And it's, uh... 5 a.m., so it's still nice and dark. And let's take a look around, see where we're going to fish, what direction. Let's fish out here. We're going to use red worms. King Harley says it's easy to snag on this lake, so be careful. It's a nice and relaxing game. Pretty amazing graphics, too. Press and hold the right mouse button to examine your catch. It's a fish, all right. That's definitely a fish. Hey, Matt Fire Gamer Zero One, how you doing today? We are trying a new game out tonight. Fishing Planet. Can you unlock other fishing spots for gameplay, or do you have to send them money? A blacktail shiner. Keep him. Doing quite well. Achievement, Lucky Bobber 1. Perform a certain number of successful strikes in a row. Five stars and 25 monies. Level 5, you unlock a new lake, it takes a bit, and it's all free. Cool. 
I think I'm currently level two, right? Okay, I felt like a little thing. A little bump. Felt another bump. Fish tried to bite and escaped. It does. I'm going to fish on another spot after this. I'll turn around and go to the other side near the uh, those weeds. Nothing's happening. I do very frequently Firearm Geek. He's asking, do I play AAA games? I do all the time. This is a variety channel. I try to bring as many different games on here as I can. Ooh, that, is that the biggest one I've gotten? Keep that. How many fish do I have on this right now? Is there a way to check? How many? See, uh, I got three on here. How many can my thing hold? Let's see here. You can't carry all your tackle with you. Your backpack is out of space. Items are placed to home storage. All the tackle in your backpack goes with you when you travel. However, the space is limited. Your backpack capacity is shown by the highlighted indicators. Backpack's full. Your new items will go to home storage. You won't be able to use them while away on a fishing trip. These items will let you take more tackle along. Okay. Interesting. Are these like real things? Nothing's there. Baits, lures. When I click outfit, nothing happens. Now let's look at inventory. Maybe I have to level up to be allowed to purchase them. Oh, that's expensive. Let's go back to fishing. How do you go back just to fishing? There's my fish keeper. So it goes off maximum weight. back to our fishing spot. Okay, we're going to go on the other side like I was talking about. And O and P. I'll try near this, uh, these weeds over here. It's a relaxing game. Whoa. I got me one. Blacktail Shiner. Keep it. Do 
Appreciate you guys joining me tonight on my stream. For you folks watching on YouTube, um, my stream address is twitch.tv slash stickyhamster. And for you guys that are watching on twitch.tv slash stickyhamster, my YouTube channel is I am Sticky Hamster. I encourage you to come on by. I happen to have 73 episodes of No Man's Sky posted. And I also have one tutorial on how to make warp fuel for your ship. Ooh, look at that one. A green sunfish. I like this spot right here. Nothing right now. I should move my spot. It's a lot more fun with the vibration thing. And the moment I reach for my T. Oh, there we go. There, got gotcha. I'm gonna make you into a little fish sandwich. That's right, sir. Catch and release? Are you kidding me? This is catch, fillet, bread, and fry and eat. I'm kinda like the, the Dave Winkleman of video gamers, except my name's Sticky Hamster and I've only played this today. How about that? In real life, yes. I have fished for walleye in Lake Erie. And I fished for coho in Lake Michigan. Coho is a type of salmon, by the way. My dad. And then, I don't know what fish I fished in my grandpa's pond, uh, in Tennessee when I was a little boy. I have, don't remember what kind of fish those were. I am not very familiar with fishing. By the way, I saw something on YouTube that was really cool. They have... You can fish with a bow and arrow. They have these people that had like bow and arrows with like a special kind of line and you have to like adjust for like the refraction in the water and they're literally like standing up on the edge of their boat and they're fishing with bow and arrow and I just thought that was the coolest thing ever. If I ever get a chance to do that, I'm going to do that. Let's try. Try like really close. Hold control to enable cursor. Okay. We're close to this. There we go. Okay, uh, try getting your line unsnagged by pulling and jerking to keep your tackle. I got it caught in the weeds. You're right. I'm about ready to break the line here if I'm not careful. Uh, what do you do to, other than just tightening the, the line up? I may have to break it. I'm gonna have to break it, right? Can I move while I do this? What, am I losing strength or something? 
not even like doing it anymore. How do I? It's done for, isn't it? Okay, B to break the line. Sure, you want to break the line? Sure. I wonder how much that cost me. Line was broken and terminal tackle is lost. Please select another rod or a symbol one in inventory. Okay, do I just drag it? And we go with a red worm on the hook. Uh, I may need to mute the microphone for just a moment. I think somebody might have a question for me. I'll be right back. Uh, I apologize. No, they didn't. Okay, so back to fishing here. And this time we're going to try to avoid the weeds. I just press escape to get out of this menu. Okay. So I kind of want it near the, the weeds, but not that near. Not in the weeds. So we're having a little bit more luck over here. So let's try it there again. Good? We're good. Uh, we're going to go for about 10 more minutes on this video. And I would like you guys in chat to let me know what games you would like to see next hour and we'll go ahead and set that up as a vote so you guys vote one of the games that i would like to play tonight we're definitely going to play some of it is no man's sky maybe play a little whoa it's on the hook get it yep yeah, there's a fishing shop too no man's sky that other shopkeeping game that we were playing earlier prison architect things like that Lots of other games. Sky's the limit, whatever you guys want to choose. I'm open to a vote tonight. Yep. Fish tried to bite and escaped. Crappy. I got a whole bunch of fish here. How long do you go for before the end of the day? Oh, it's only 5.51 a.m. I feel so fishy. Okay. Have you been on my YouTube channel yet, Firearm Geek? Got another one. I feel like I'm still in the tutorial. In game, it shows that it's 5.55 a.m. So far, the games... Ooh, got it. Bait was eaten or lost. Gotta put another bait on the line here. So I'm going to set the vote up next hour so far. Um, no Man's Sky, Shop Heroes, Prison Architect, uh, any other games you guys are interested in? Do that uh, in about four minutes here.
like it. I like the game. I'm not familiar with that game, uh, King. What is that? What is that game about? Yeah, the bobber's moving. Got another one. How many of these can I put on my my fish keeper? That one's really light. That one's like 0.15 of a pound. There's a little itty bitty teeny tiny one. Sun's coming up. All right. That was Shop Heroes that the others are talking about. I'm going to fish until they tell me my fish keeper is full. We'll wrap it up and see how much uh, we made. So we may go a little late on this video. Oh, that's nice. That one's nice. That's one of our bigger ones we've gotten. All right. We're almost out of worms. And lots of fish. Fish tried to bite and escaped. Does anybody have any idea how many fish you can hold on that thing? It's moving. There we go. Yeah, let's press I and look at our inventory real quick. Okay, I have 16 fish. Total weight, 5.6 pounds of 8.9 pounds. So. We can sort according to the weight. So our biggest fish so far is a little bit over half a pound, 10 inch. That's a lot of fish, man. That's 16 fish. But they're little tiny ones, so they like smelt. Well, let's go ahead and do a little more fishing. I like it. I'm more relaxing on fishing. Best thing about this game, no mosquitoes.
Yeah, this is basically miracle fishing. If it was if it was too much like real fishing, it probably wouldn't be fun. It's just like, you know, hunting games. Have you ever seen any of the hunting games out there? We should play a hunting game sometime. I haven't played any hunting games, you know, where you go bow hunting and rifle hunting for a good old delicious delicious bambies. I do appreciate you suggesting this. Enjoyable. Nice and relaxing. There we go. That's another big one. There's like so many fish. It's like it's underwater. They've got like a little take a number thing. They're lined up like uh, at the deli. Oh, in the upper left, you see the fish tail stringer thing? That shows how full my stringer is. 6.5 of 8.9 pounds. Come on now. Okay, it's wiggling. It's wiggling, man. Speaking of wiggling, we just dropped some frames on the stream. So hopefully Comcast is not going to start misbehaving. Hopefully we're not going to get bumped offline. If we do, guys, just refresh your browsers. I'm going to keep trying to stream for a while, but it looks like it is dropping frames right now. I don't know if there's a storm anywhere near. I just made it to level 3. We're at 7.029 pounds of 8.995 pounds. It might have just been a little burp. Looks like the stream is stabilized. We're going to fill our stringer up. And then we'll call that a day. A couple more. Let's try a little. A mouse is moving on its own. It's like rolling off the... Okay. I'm out of the current bait, so we're going to switch bait. Okay, somebody's got to start the cornbread up... We're gonna eat. We gotta get some cornbread. Yeah, I got that bait. Currently have 796 in game dollars, so. They'll pay us a little bit for these fish, I guess. A little bit more. Oh, you know what? I love how many grits. How many grits and eggs over easy? Oh. And real sausage gravy. I'm on a grain free thing right now, though. Been for a while, been feeling great from it. Have a little bit of animal protein every day, a little veg. Not touch bread. Every once in a while, I will have something. Like, for example, I ordered some spicy noodles off of Amazon. So, 
every I mean once a week I'll go and make myself some spicy noodles, but staying away from grains. Okay, we're at 7.865 of 8.9. Let's keep going just a little bit longer. This uh, when we take our next break, it's gonna run into the next hour. I wonder if you get experience also. What you? Excuse me. Sorry, that was embarrassing. That was my tea saying hello. In fact, we'll have some more. I wonder if you get more experience, like when you like go back home with the fish or something, or if you only get it right now. Moving. It was eaten or lost. Reel it in. Oh. Okay. Absolute last fish, no matter what size it is, next one. We're at eight point three on four of eight point nine nine. If you're enjoying my stream and my videos, please do me a favor of telling your friends, and also please click that follow button. I want to do my best to be the best variety streamer that I can. You guys can help me out by spreading the word. I do need your help with that. I do appreciate every time. That's the last fish. Okay, now. So, finished. Now, what do we do here? Press I for inventory. Go to back home, map, inventory, shop, statistics, fish keep net, leaderboard, friends. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Thank you for clicking that follow button. I don't know what the book does. What does the book do? Oh, that's like the uh, tutorials. Okay. So we'll click back home. So we got 37 bucks, zero coins, no penalties. Hey, Lil, thank you very much for that follow. 25 fish, one snag, one line break, another break. We got a lucky bobber achievement. So we got 69 stars, 62 uh, game dollars or whatever, and three coins. So we're traveling, and that takes us back to the uh, main map. We will be revisiting this several times. Every once in a while, we're going to want to go uh, virtual fishing. And I appreciate you guys watching this video on YouTube. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And for you guys on Twitch.tv, please come on by my YouTube channel sometime. My YouTube channel is I Am Sticky Hamster. If you'd like to just pop up an easy link to click, you type exclamation point YouTube in chat. Thank you for watching.